Today, I wanna to show you guys how to do this simple ink transition inside of Premiere Pro. So let's jump straight on in. Before we get there, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over to Invato Elements and we are gonna search for an ink transition. There might be some free ones out there. I'm not too sure. I use Invato Elements for all of my assets. I have a link in the description. And what we're gonna do is come down to stock video and look for a cool ink transition that we wanna use. You know what, I'm happy with this one. So I download and let's jump into Premiere Pro. So inside Premiere Pro, I've got my two videos. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna drag your ink transition onto the top. So when it goes to black, I'm gonna cut it and delete that. We just need to go from one color to the other. And then what I'm also gonna do is I'm gonna right click and come down to show clip keyframes time remapping and speed. I wanna change the speed of this thing so that it doesn't happen so slowly over time. And what I wanted to do is kinda of wanted to go slow, fast, and then slow down again. I've got videos about speed ramping on my channel if you wanna check them out. I'm just doing this pretty quickly. Oh, what a strange transition. So I don't actually know if I like this one, but anyway, for the sake of the tutorial, I'm just gonna keep using it. All right, so I have my transition on top. I'm just gonna label it a different color so you can see and the two videos at the bottom. So what you need to do now is figure out exactly where you want your video to transition. So at this point, so I'm gonna cut off the end and then drag your ink transition over the end of that clip. And then what you're gonna do is you are going to cut the bottom off so these two are the same in length and you are going to add something called a track mat. So we come down to effects and look for track mat key and add it onto the video layer. Now click on the video layer, come up to effect controls, scroll down to track matte key. Over here where it says matte in this drop down, you want to select video layer two, which is your ink transition layer. Depending on which layer it's on, that's the one you're gonna choose. And then what you wanna do is change matte alpha to matte luma. And now you can see we've got something going on. Now you can nest these clips, hit okay, push it up one level and drag your other video underneath it. Now, when you play through the video, it looks something like that. Not the best example at the end there, I won't lie, I'll probably pick a better ink transition, but you get the idea that is how it works. Hey, if this video helped you in some way, please smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, otherwise check out some of my other videos. I'll see you guys around. Peace out.